Gears of War Mini Cooper. The Mega Cooper. Macro Cooper. Mm. Maximum Cooper. I'll take this straight. I'll <clears throat> Alright, give me a sec to go execute this guy. The first thing I have to do is hide behind this surprisingly bulletproof- Oh, never mind. Fuck. Alright, he's dead. Bench just annihilates itself in front of my eyes. Oh, thank you, Bench. Fucking prick. Oh, what the fuck? And I have died. Why'd you do that? Man. <sighs> I'm filled with anger. I mean, you fucking team killed me last time. <laughs> that was incidental in, like, the stupidest possible way. Fucking... There was no possible way I could have predicted that. You fucking wily coyote me to death. I'll take this straight. Cover me from the garage. Like, that didn't even make sense. I don't... Why the fuck... Why is the execution not working? What? I don't know, why it is that? It's making me do a back step? Like, ow, what the fuck? And I'm dead. Why are you dead? I don't know, man, why? Close holes by throwing grenades into them. Yep. You know, they say you can open a lot of doors in life by throwing a grenade at them. What the man. fuck is this Eldridge bullshit? <laughs> Fucking seashell man? Normal. That's the ocean man. I'll take this take me by the hand. Me Lead the me to the land. Lead me to Japan. Man. <laughs> Lead me to Iran. Oh. Oh, suddenly you don't want to get led by the hand anymore. Oh. Ow. Stop that. <laughs> Halo 1 death pose. Man. I'm very irritated at the world in general. Shit. I'll take this straight. Cover me from the garage. Alright, hold on. Can we get him? Yeah, this bench isn't gonna fucking hold out for too long. Yeah, I got him. Shut up, man. You're not allowed to like things. Fucking like sure, man. Alright, blew up that guy. That guy dropped his grenades. Did he drop his grenades? Doesn't look, fucking look like it. Reavers! I could use some help over here. Hold on, I'm dealing with my own problems here. I disagree with you, but okay. You're welcome. There, and I collapsed the Ow. thing, so now you won't die. 
down now as opposed to sliding down. I look at both of the cars coming towards me. I don't even know how that happens. I hold up a sign that says, oh no, with an exclamation mark, and then I get squished. You shouldn't have been even been able to fucking stand there. Well, you fucking got me. <laughs> Hold on. I don't feel like that's my fault. I think it is. Oh, I'm shooting this guy for you. I need more ammo. Last guy's right there. Take him out. There should still be two more hunters. Uh. Well, I don't see him. Hold on. Maybe it doesn't exist. Yeah, see, they're right there. Okay, yeah, well, they only moved in after, so... That's one. That's two. That does hold that gun toward. Well, it was more of a mantle. He mantled into the grenade you just What the on. fuck? Man? Ah, shit. Do I want to get in cover? Yeah, I am in cover. But, uh, what are we gonna do about this? We shoot him with guns until he dies. I kinda wish their heads were actually shaped like that. What, the big tall thing? Yeah. Why? It's just a hat. Wouldn't it be better if that's just what they look like? Hammer of Dawn here. Yeah, but right there. You should grab the Dawn. Ah, fine. What slots is it taking on? It takes a regular gun slot. Uh, wait, I... I'll take your sniper wait, rifle. How did I... Wait. It's right here. Oh. Yeah. That was a mulcher. Rest in peace, my sniper rifle. Consume. You take so much. Is this the first time getting the Hammer of Dawn in this game? Why can't I... <clears throat> what? No, he is. Did he? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Isn't Alex that the first it. game? Uh... No, I'm pretty sure we have those. I don't know. Anyway, why can't I blind fire this thing? That's not how that works. I should be allowed to. Alright, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Got him. Wait, which one? Hold on, I got him. He's already down. That seems like overkill. But I got him. Yeah, I fucking guess, man. He's already dead. Man. I got him. That feels like... I got that guy. I fucking guess. It feels unnecessary, at the very least. Would Oh, would you rather have just had to fight all of them? Also, there's your boom shield back, you fucking weirdo. Right. I think all of the locusts that have like regular rifles now all have like lancers. Yeah. I mean, I guess they just. I mean, they can't get resupply from the caverns, so they're probably just taking our shit. It's still weird that the locust invented the fucking hammer burst. Uh. Okay. Alright, that's fine. Look at those volumetric lighting. Yep. That's like a toddler watching a bookshelf <coughs> topple towards them. The Never thought they'd get to just why? That's not what we're doing. Isn't it? No. That looks like a specific object that does something. Not... Yeah, we need to ride the crane, so hammer of dawning it out of existence is not exactly helpful. I use my mind powers to destroy things. <sighs> Just get on the fucking lift. Also, you'll need to shoot the enemy. Since I can't... Got it. Yeah, I fucking guess, man. Got him. Okay, wait. <laughs> I cannot give you any covering fire. You'll you could have used the crane to smack him. <laughs> Instantly? You could have. Instantaneously. If you were really certified to use that thing, you could have. Crane certified. Yes. I mean, it, there's no way they let you in one of those things without proper training. I'm sushi certified. Or I was. It probably expired by now. Just like the sushi. <laughs> Which is weird, because I've never worked in a sushi place. <laughs> You get the certification for the hell of it? No, it was a general, like, food thing, but it included, like, sushi or whatever. Because it included seafood, despite the fact that I've never worked in a place that had Ow. seafood. Alright, hold on. Oh, I got this, I got this, I got this. I got this. Uh, can I 
Do you? I got this. Do you have Shut this? Up, I've got this. Oh shit. I, I even press pause at the fuck. Fuck. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm taking fire from multiple angles, but I've got this. Just you really do have to trust me here. Nah, see I told you. Mm-hmm. That cardboard box protected them. It's like I'm looking at a wallpaper. I think we're clear. You're not, but get on the lift anyway. I mean, there's no one else around. You get this box to protect what you. What if I... What if I... You'll kill me, and I will die, and you'll be stuck on this lift forever. 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 Millions of years will go by, Man. and you'll be stuck on this lift. Great. <laughs> I can't just leave. No. How are you gonna get down? Jump. Okay, Doc, get in that crane and get me across. Which crane? The crane. How the hell am I supposed to get the from... other one? Oh, that crane? Uh, yeah. That one. Man. Oh, you don't have to tell me twice. <sighs> it's fine. <clears throat> I'm filled with unending rage. Well. And the other crane inexplicably moves itself back. The ghost of the construction worker who used that crane decided to move it back. Shit. Why does it... It only starts the lock-on sequence once it's aimed at someone. I can't just use it. Yeah, I think that might be a balancing issue for multiplayer. Well, okay, okay, look at look at my screen. Yeah, I know. When I point it here, it does nothing, but when I point it at the cinder block, suddenly it manifests. That's weird. Yeah, it's because it has to be pointed at a physics object. And not just the map collision? It's still weird. Yeah, it's because there were fucking... I think there was an issue in multiplayer where you could shoot it through walls. Mm. So they put it so that it can only like be used on certain objects. Anyway, this means my pistol is better than yours. It's not a pistol. Yeah, it is. No, it isn't. Yeah, come on. It's not even. Okay, whatever. Kill this guy. I got this guy. That boom shield almost deflected it. What if he fucking uh, deflected the hammer of dawn beam at you like in an L shape? Man. <laughs> Kill that reaver. I know. Hold on. Keep it off me. Ow. Man. Wow. I think the missile bounced off my shield and hit you and killed us both. <laughs> Couldn't get me up any faster than that, huh? The missile will get you up. Great. What a wake-up call. Oh, man. Ah, for fuck's sake. I'm just surprised it didn't get rid of my boom shield by getting in the fucking crane. <coughs> At least I don't have to worry about getting shot in here. That would suck. Oh man, I could easily think of a way to make this worse. It's like how fucking playing- Ow, what? You know, you could get into, like, cover, maybe? I tried to reach it with them and it just didn't have the length. Man. Fucking. <laughs> anyway, but what if you could get shot while you were in this and I every see time you- your hammer of dawn is as big as mine. Okay, but like, what Sweet. if you could get shot when you were in the crane and every time you're not actively using the crane, the thing moves back to its original position? Right. Like, this could be so much worse. It's like the fucking, uh, Mac gun at the end of Halo Reach. Yeah. That section sucks. That section's fine. Like, playing it on Legendary, where you fucking die in two fucking seconds, you have to constantly get in and out of the fucking thing, and it moves back to the center position every time it does. That's fine. Oh, get on the platform. <sighs> I have to wait for my thing. You know, Emil's house is down here. Man. Missed. Got the other guy though. Two more people will inexplicably show up. I think they're not gonna stop coming until you get on the platform. No, they stopped coming last time. I think that was only because you got within a close enough proximity of it. Stop 
the fuck? I watched you not shoot him. I think that got him. Recombines like the T-1000. Man. Yeah, no, see, we're good. Gears of War has some of the best destroyed cities out of any fucking series. Mm. Anyway, yeah, so the enemies totally do stop if you kill them all. People die when they're killed. No, they don't. Okay, Dom, get in that train and get me across. What if Dom just said no, fuck you, and then continued to play the rest of the game? And just left Marcus here? Man. Like, damn. That's cold. That's cold, Dom. Is that an oil refinery right next to, like, the fucking normal buildings and shit? The answer to that is yes, but you got, uh, the, which one is the oil refinery and which one are the normal buildings mixed up? Oh. This universe is just like that. Oh, shit. Hold on, I got him, I got him, I got him. Got him. Who just left the Hammer of Dawn lying on the ground? Man. You'd think we'd always have one with us or something, like Jack would fucking carry one in his fucking compartment. Or he'd just have one built on. Yeah, but you probably don't want to trust the AI with fucking giant space lasers. Although... For the most part, AI going rogue and killing people is not really a thing in Gears of War. Yeah. Man, can I dual wield? I mean, I guess there's that one. What if I could dual wield two <coughs> Hammer of Dawns? What if? I mean, there's only one satellite overhead, so I don't know what that would do. Dual wield. Man. Can I get a rapid fire Hammer of Dawns? That Reaver's coming up. Gotta shoot it. Hold on. Oh, fuck you. Oh, wow, I deflected oh, I it. What the fuck? I actually deflected the fucking uh, I killed river him. shot. Hey, give me my boom shield back, you cunts. The game tried to make me drop it. The boom shield blows off in the wind like it's made of paper. Man, it opens up like an umbrella indoors. Man, don't open a boom shield indoors. It'll give you seven years of bad luck or something. I thought you were going to say cancer. Yeah, it'll give you seven years of cancer. You got tickers. That works. You missed. Good enough. <clears throat> oh, wait, wait, wait. Stop it. I wasn't gonna shoot you, I was waiting to see Tickers. if something was gonna pop out. Tickers. Don't worry, I got it. Oh, cool! I can block ticker explosions Ow. with the boom shield. I downed myself. That's fucking cool. I downed myself. Yeah, I know. Ow. I can completely block tickers. Man. Oh, I got him. You missed. What? I saw meat chunks. That was the body next to him. Okay, I'm pretty sure I got him that time. He gets back up. Man. If you see an ammo box, I need it. Yeah. Wait, guys. I swear you could beat those things off the goddamn railing in the original game. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a guy right behind us. Ah, shit. Oh, no! Shit. Oh! Well, I don't know what you want from me. You just let him do that to me. <laughs> you watch. Well, I mean, at that point, there was literally nothing I could do. I got the tickers ticker. multiple times. I got the ticker. Okay, not that one though. That's still cool. The fact that I can just ignore them. All right, wait, wait, wait. You know he's not out yet, right? Let's do this. Uh, fuck. come on, come on, we're on the fire. Yeah, I think you got him. He's worth it. Is it? Probably. Oh, 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 wait. Okay, fine. 
Ah, for fuck's Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> and you just watched. That was instant. He jumped over and, like, that was one frame. He fucking got me, man. Once he starts sawing you, your character is dead. I can't act. There's no way to save you from that animation. Don't even try. Yep. Tempers. Tickers. I killed the ticker. Are you doing this because you think it's funny or because it has infinite ammo? Why would I waste my weapon's ammo? I just have this. This will work all the time. No, I'm... Never mind. The laser beam is infinite. Yeah, I know. That's what I was saying from a- never mind. Like, a motivation standpoint. Shut up. Ma'am. Hey, it fucking worked that time. Come on. I'm grabbing those grenades. You sure you don't want to back up before the other guy comes in? Nice. It doesn't matter. You have to walk forward. Also, I think he's dead. What? No, he's there. That guy was already there. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on, I got him. I mean, it's a one-hit kill for most things. I could have sworn you could run faster with the fucking... Oh, right, that's how you do the fucking uh, boom shield wall. Ah, fuck. You're fine. Nope, no, 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 no. Help. Somebody, help. It off. Fight through the pain! Here, before we get on there, let's roast them. What the fuck? Wait. I've got to wait for the second one. Don't follow me yet. I want to put this down. Oh, there it is. Come on. Come on, back up. There's a lot of these fuckers. Yep. Oh, hey, that grappling hook went off before it fucking. before the guy came on. I think because you killed him on the wall. Yeah. Here, I'll distract them, you fucking shoot at them. Man, remember when we evaporated the newest Carmine with one of these? Ah, what? Shit. My boom shield. Ah, it's still there. Oh. Ah, yeah, it's still there. Shit, I can barely see a thing. There's a Voltock pistol here. You gonna take your boom shield? I can't take it because we have to climb We're over this, I believe. Um, I can chat. You can try putting it down in the wall and then grabbing it again on the other side. Copy that. We've almost finished loading the bomb onto the chopper. They should be headed in your direction within minutes. Hopefully we'll be in place by the time they get here. I'll report in when we've made it to the tunnels below. Delta out. Why did we even leave if we're just going right back in? All good, Marcus. Because we needed to talk to Hawkman. <laughs> well, we didn't use radio. Yeah, I can't take cover with the boom shield. I like despite the fact that we're going into a giant fucking sinkhole, we still have Hammer of Dawn coverage. Yep. T-Mobile gives you the best hammer of dawn coverage of, uh, than any other provider. Let me know if you see an ammo crate. I need one. Oh man, but what about all the ammo I can get? Ah, fuck. God damn it. Alright, right, I'm behind this wall. Can you get me? Side. Wait, why don't they just get in the helicopter and pick us up? We don't have any to spare. They're all existing in the evac. The civilians are less important. <sighs> Whatever, man. Aren't they? 
in this context. What is the matter with you? Uh, I'm right, though. Most of the remaining humans on Earth live in Jacinto. Well, yeah, that's why it's more important that we defend the thing or finish off the fighting the locust rather than. Oh. Yeah, but doing this will blow up Jacinto! Yeah, but we, like, one So they should leave! We can spare one helicopter. <sighs> we really can't. They keep getting shot down. Well, then and they're not doing their job. almost <laughs> certainly would get shot down in here. Then they're not doing their job correctly, apparently. Cantus. can stop, dude. Dude, they're right there. Why would I stop if it keeps working? I'm gonna grab that ammo. Nice. Well, are you fucking kidding me? What? You ran forward and despawned the grenades I was trying to pick up. Man, you should have said something. <sighs> I feel like that fucking guy in the comedy sketch about that guy who always has a knife on him. I mean, come on. It's useful here. If it'll activate. Let's kill all the locusts. Also, I'm... Ah, nice. Uh... Not my fault. Someone put a wall in my way. Man. Keep moving! Place isn't gonna last long. Buildings in the Gears universe are made out of only the most flammable materials. Wood. Super flammable wood. Come on, come on. Oh yeah, you get to look out the side, it's like a fucking ride. Also, the yeah. elevator going sideways. Yep. Okay, you know how tech in the Aliens universe is supposed to be, like, science fiction, but, like, practical? What's with this fucking elevator? This feels like the opposite of that. What, the elevator going sideways? Yeah, I know, but right? Well, it's because the building's on its side. No, I mean just tech in the Gears universe. I guess. This feels like this is supposed to be form over function. Which, I mean, yeah. Don't get shoot in the face. Um. You motherfucker. Wait, I wanna go. Brew back. What if it was the brew back? Uh, man, stop talking. Man. Shot down for my radical beliefs. Reavers were one thing, but a broomock. What are you racist? They yes. Ride them. So can we. Face Marcus gives you looks like he wants to fuck it. He does. So can we. He does want to fuck it. There is like one image result for broomock on a six one one. Oh, well, there's like three. It's still three one. Deal with it, loser. No, fuck you. I've got the guns. You take the yeah, you've got the rockets. Yeah, I'm the gun man. Well, I mean, I'm the machine gun guy, you're the rocket guy. Well, no, I also have... Are there fire rockets? I don't know, X? Yeah, I guess. Shoot those fucking containers. You know, you can hold the reload button down to cool it. Yeah, I know. I have a lot of controls here, man. What are the fucking controls in-universe for riding the Brumac? I don't know, maybe it's like the fucking, uh, Silk Striders in Morrowind. You have, like, open access to its brain, so you poke it to make it go in certain directions. I doubt that very much. Well, it looks what, like, in the first game, it looked like it was just a dude sitting in a lazy boy with two joysticks. I mean, maybe 
that that's what was going on here. Fucking knows. If it's joysticks, then we definitely gotta have something wired into its brains. Maybe it literally just controls the two things on its arms. Man. There's just a series of complicated counterbalances. Great. It just walks and finds butter in its mouth. We put peanut butter in its mouth. Oh, man. You dangle a sandwich in front of its head. How did that uh, fucking boomer get inside that tiny little thing? One. It was standing on like a little pedestal outcropping. Yep. Oh, maybe they airlifted him? They had like a rope attached to one of the fucking levers and they just flew him in. There's a surprising amount of destructible environment in this game. Yeah. Corpser! You see, this is the kind of public transportation America needs. It's time for the Corpser fight. How are they telling the Corpser what to do? Is this a button mash bit, or...? I had to do it. They gave us an objective for that, and it was just a thing. Come like on, that. Waddles. Man. Anyway, but right, this is what American public transportation should look like. This should just be a big dinosaur. Yeah. Like, unironically, even. I remember there's some fucking I city. feel like there's a significant limit to the amount of that you could have in any one place. Okay, uh, Also, they'd fight each other or have sex in public, and it'd be a problem. That's fine. But, uh, okay, that reminds me of some city that actually built, like, a robot stegosaurus or something you can take rides on. It's slow and it's yeah, like a tourist thing. It's like a bus. They don't let you on the inside part. Yeah, but it's like, we should have stuff like that. Even if it's impractical, just stuff that looks cool would They had big animatronic dinosaurs at the zoo when I was a kid. Yeah, but like... I have a picture of me sitting on top of a dinosaur with a T-Rex trying to do this or some shit. Yep. Okay, oh, wait, why can't I move? Man. Am I stuck? Yeah, hold on. That also reminds me of that image from some fantasy thing of some guy selling donuts off of the fucking spikes of one of those dinosaurs. Like, he picks the donut up and gives it to you. Okay, I had to fucking back their fucking uh, guy in. His ass was too fat. Actually, I think it was bagels. Would you, would you buy a bagel from the spike of the dinosaur? Sure. Our Brumax ass was too fat. I had to back it into the room. You had to throw it back. Would you, the Brumac? Yeah. Does it pass the hardness test? I mean, I think so. It knows how to use a computer. Know how to speak. None of the, well, some of the locals know how to speak, but most of them can't pronounce English vowels. What about the boomers? The boomers can speak. Boom. That's how they talk. They also fucking go gears when they see gears. They all talk like fucking Nemesis oh. does. I was gonna say they talk the like stars. I was gonna say they just talk like Pokemon, but I guess no, Pokemon. because they don't say their own name. Oh, the boomers say boom. That's close. Yeah, but they say other things too. Yeah. You know, there could be people on the torture barge. Being tortured? Ties on that barge. Bad. Also, this would be a pretty decent transportation thing. Right? It only works in caves. Well, yeah, but how else are we gonna get around big caverns? Our Not planet, with this. Our planets have big caverns. Now, logically speaking, that should turn into a big monster in like 10 minutes. I think he just killed it. Yeah, but... Like, I think, also, I think the metal might just weigh it down. So it might be a monster just at the bottom of oh, the... Oh no, Nemesis! Planet. Oh, I can, those are real, I can shoot them. Yep. Weird. It's surprising how much of Gears of War's, like, environment is not actually, like, just a texture floating around in the background. They're actually, like, things that exist. Which was slightly less blurry, though. I need you to shoot the fucking cedars. Yeah, hold on. What if you were using the Hammer of Dawn on the back of this thing? Yeah. I mean, we're underground, but still. We should just take the Hammer of Dawn satellites and make them lasers we can just use. Like, just mount them on the fucking tank or Inevitably, something. Inevitably, the Locust would steal it. Yeah, but I mean... It'd be like the fucking... They are, steal what, literally man? everything that we make. Yeah, but that becomes less of a problem overall at some point. 
because eventually, even if they steal our tech, they just can't use it as well or you know, big numbers as we can. They need you to shoot the big pillar. Also, they don't have a space in this crew, so... We Both don't either. We have satellites. Yeah, but we don't have spaceships or anything. Yeah, but still. Shoot the big pillar with your rocket. Yeah, hold on. Well, it's like, the point is, they wouldn't be able to use it as well as we could. that those have never been in the games. One more to go. Most things in Halo have not been in the games. Yeah, but it's still. It feels like a pretty like obvious enemy choice for somebody. <coughs> we could have had the Yggdrasil armor as a fucking juggernaut mode in multiplayer. Juggernaut hasn't even been in the game since like Halo 2. Eh, there's no point if it's not as fast as it was in the thing. Again, because you could wear Spartan armor inside the Yggdrasil suit. Yeah, I know, but still. So your character could literally just get in and out of it. At the very least, it'd be a cool campaign thing. Have like a section where you're just playing as a fucking armored core for like 10 minutes. Like, they can make Halo games that don't play like other normal Halo games are like special niche things. Like, ODST didn't need to be made on the Halo 3 engine. It could have been a completely new, unique thing that played differently. Well, I mean, it being on the Halo 3 engine was fine. Yeah, fucking, it was limited, though, because there was a fucking pretty hard limit what they wanted to do. Because they wanted that game to be different, but they sensed they were fucking using the Halo 3 engine. They had to cut most of what they wanted to do with it. Yeah. Because they just couldn't jam all the stuff they wanted to into that game. And considering that they were able to fucking then make Halo Reach's engine in less time than it took to make Halo 3's engine. Yeah, but Halo It probably would have been better for them to just make a new engine. Yeah, but Halo 3 ODST wasn't it wasn't meant to be a big mainline Halo. It was supposed to have two campaigns. Yeah, but still, it wasn't meant to be like a whole big thing like Halo 2 or 3 were. Well they just wanted to put it as an add-on to Halo 3. They didn't say it was gonna be a small game. Yeah, I know, but still, it wasn't gonna be a big game. So, I mean, putting that much time and money and resources... Waddles destroyed our fucking helicopter. Yep. But anyway, putting that much time and money and resources and developing something that wasn't going to be, like, the next Halo 3 would have potentially been a sink of money, and Microsoft probably wouldn't have been willing to let them do that. The Brumac is getting larger. Yep. Why is this cutscene so low resolution? I don't know. It's higher resolution on yours. What the fuck? Oh, yeah, that's because this thing's kind of... Is this a like, fucking pre-rendered cutscene? Looks like... I don't know. Because that's the only reason why it would have a static resolution. We lost the light mass bomb. So close. It's gotta be a way. Don't we just have another of those? We don't have one we can fly in. See, this is a much more rapid and violent transformation. Well, that's because it survived. Well, I know also, but it's like... The way the Lambent... It doesn't look the way the Lambent do in the other games, either. This looks like Biolante with those fucking tentacles. Normal. Like, this is a much more considerably different transformation. Although, it didn't look like that ten seconds ago. Yeah. Uh, the other... It looked cooler before that! Eh. <laughs> is it exploding, Lambent? Yeah, like the wretches, but way bigger! Then I think we've got our bomb. I don't know. I'm surprised the bomb didn't go off to the also, is it rooted to the ground now? Yeah, it looks like. Weird. Yeah, this they really did not have a clear idea of what they wanted the, uh, the Lambent to be until Gears 3. Yeah. I guess the idea is that it's just some kind of biological contaminant. Which is weird, because the Lambent have been around since the first game. It all looks like squares on my screen. Yeah. Achievement. What an ending, right? The real ending was getting here. 
Like, you're on the victory lap by the time you get on the broom act. Yeah, but, like, for a final boss, I feel like... It's not a boss, it's just a set piece. No, for a boss, we should have had the fucking duel, like, another... Okay, that guy we fought on the fucking big, uh, Reaver, he should have come back on his own broom act, and we should have fucking well, He's got, like, a directly. super broom act? Yeah, and we should have fought him directly and pushed him into the land. The Lambert. Chad broom act? Yeah, and we should have pushed him into the fucking emulsion, and then that's our bit. We're destroying Jacinto. Yeah, but it was a sack. Sorry, Jacinto, you were cool. Eh. Goodbye, Embry Square. Mm. Crunchy cutscene. Yeah, I don't know why these final two cutscenes are pre rendered. I feel like they maybe ran out of budget. Well, no, pre-rendered cutscenes take more resources to make. Maybe they ran out of space on the disc? In-game cutscenes would have taken up less space. Eh. They ran out of caring. Because pre-rendered cutscenes are just extra dedicated memory, like, because it's a video file. Eh. Uh, you see, this cutscene takes up less space because it's formatted as a GIF. We sloshed the locust. Slurp juice. Man. Uh, you see, it was foreshadowing. This is the slurp juice combined with the emulsion would then go on to be in Fortnite. Surprised there aren't locust skins in fucking Fortnite, considering that there are Gears skins in that game. Eh. Did we just have all these boats prepared? I guess. They're not very big. Mm. It feels like not a lot of people made it out of this. Oh, weird, the crease is gone. And suddenly the world as you knew is gone. So where the fuck did Queen Mira actually get off to? Like, where'd she go? She, uh, presumably she got on that big bug that didn't exist yet. Man. She left. What if she was just hiding behind a box and Dom and Cole just missed her? She was hiding behind a painting with the eyes cut out so she's watching you as you run away. Great. Fucking... Yeah, why was Cole on a different helicopter? Yeah. I'm also here. Haha, -ha, suck it, Dom. My love interest still exists. For now. <laughs> why is the caution backwards on the fucking helicopter? Did they mirror this fucking video file? No, they probably mirrored the texture. Fucking. Hmm. That feels weirdly specific. Well, they probably did one half of the texture and then just flipped it over. Well, I guess, but I mean, is that on every fucking Raven in the uh, game? Because the only the reason why we have backwards text on real vehicles is so that you can fucking see them in a goddamn mirror. Yeah, but also like, because if if every fucking Raven is normal, that means they totally mirrored the video file for whatever yeah. reason. I would be fascinated to know if they actually did that, and also why. It's like how they mirrored Twilight Princess. Well, they had a reason for that. Because no one fucking plays Zelda as left-handed. Yeah. They could have just made you do it. It's not like people use who play those games use swords in real life. Yeah, but it's weird, because you have to, just have to do buttons and shit with your non dominant Epic hand. is the best company in the world. Also, with your fucking Wii thing, that increases the chance of accidentally letting go and bowling your fucking TV. Man. I want the last one to be like a punch to the stomach. Yeah. It's just a quote from Stalin. Man. <laughs> Damn! It's like, wow, going out in a bang, huh? It's like, shit. Alright. We... We Gears Award 2. Is anyone out there? Can you hear me? This is Adam Phoenix. Can you hear me? What have you... I don't remember this. Was this exclusive to Insane Difficulty? Mm hmm. I guess it's like a legendary ending. I guess. Gears doesn't really have those, but I've never seen this fucking version uh, before, because the last time I played it, we fucking got knocked out like 10 seconds before the end. Man. 
Uh, man. Weird.